Something is killing these people, and I'm gonna find out what it is. Oh. That's great, Lloyd. Okay, well, I have a really hot date with a guy rocking an eight pack in an hour, so maybe we can hurry this up a little. How do I kill this thing? Now, you may recognize her face from the hit supernatural show, Lost Girl on Showcase. But today, you can actually meet Rachel Scarston at the 25th Annual Comic-Con at the, the Suburban Collection Showplace in Novi. And we're very happy to have her here in studio to talk about your projects, uh, your visit to Detroit, and why you're tired. You stayed up late last <laughs> night. I know. Well, we were actually filming until about 2 wow. a.m. on Friday. And then my flight left at 6.30. So I got about 75 minutes of sleep. And it was one of those situations where I was at home and I thought, is it worth sleeping for 75 minutes? No, definitely not. <laughs> but I went for it. I yeah. went for it because, you know, I was committed. And I, I woke up and I almost missed my flight, but I made it. You're looking bright eyed and bushy tailed. So, <laughs> again, that. it's Thank good you. to, good to have you here. Your <laughs> What, uh, how did you get started uh, in your career? Because you have a very uh, healthy resume. You've got a lot of movies you've been a part of. I've been blessed to be. A, doing this for quite a while now, and um, B, have been involved in, in many different projects. But I sort of fell into it, actually. I, acting found me. I was um, at a school for the arts doing visual arts and, and music, and my dad passed away when I was little. And a show, a local television show, actually did a little piece on him, and my mom okay. spoke, and an agent just happened to see my brother and myself. And my brother, of course, had zero interest in the acting <laughs> business, and I thought, yeah, I could do that. And the rest was history. I actually, um, a couple of fans from the Comic Con found uh, my first honeycomb commercial, which nice. was my very first job. <laughs> I was totally mortified. I thought that that was lost forever in obscurity, but nope, they found it. In the internet age, <laughs> yes. it will be discovered. <laughs> now, of course, you are in movies like uh, The Vow or Vow, also American Pie Beta House, and most recently, uh, Lost Girl. Tell us about your, your role in Lost Girl and your character. My character, oh, she's so great in Lost Girl. Um, one of the wonderful things about the show of Lost Girl is that it's just a show where females are, are truly empowered and, and they're layered and complex. And um, But we also have lots of hot babes. I, I think you met Paul <laughs> yesterday, actually. Um, yes. I was going to say yourself included in that, but OK. <laughs> Thank you. Um, and Tamsin is, is just this sort of kick-ass uh, Valkyrie. And she comes in and causes all sorts of trouble, uh, which is always fun. People, people ask me at the Comic-Con, oh, you play such a, a bad character. What's that like? And actually, a couple of my friends said to me, you know, you play bad really well. <laughs> so should we be nervous about that? Or, but no, it's fine. And I've heard in other interviews that uh, being a, a bad character, a bad guy, is actually a little more challenging. You get to have a little more fun, a little more latitude. Yeah, from an actor's perspective, you want to be able to layer a bad character. You want, because every, every bad character, I mean, as humans, we, we have bad sides to us, but uh, there, there is good in everyone, and, and you want to be able to bring that forward. But it's also just way more fun to, to get in trouble. than Definitely. To be the Story person. of my life. We got some uh, information for Comic-Con on the screen. But while we're looking at that, how did you get involved with all this? With Comic-Con? Well, Comic -Con, I yeah. actually had, uh, I'm on Twitter, and I had been getting a bunch of tweets from people saying, oh, come to this Comic-Con, come to that Comic-Con. And a couple of the actors on my show were involved with my wonderful booking agent, Holly. And they mentioned to me, you know, you should come along. And they just seemed to have so much fun. They'd come back from these weekends, and they would have met all these amazing fans and, and had a blast. And, of course, I'm also a huge Walking Dead fan. So the thought <laughs> okay. of perhaps meeting some of those actors was Definitely. a great lure. And I, I did. I met Scott, who... Uh, plays Herschel on The Walking Dead, and he was lovely. So, yeah, my weekend was amazing. <laughs> Rachel, thank you so much thank for stopping you very by. Thank you much. And you guys can check Rachel out at Comic Con today from 10:30 until 5. Otherwise, you can check out Joanne and Chris right now. <laughs> I think Comic Con's way more exciting.